This is a tutorial of using GPhoto 2 to download pictures in Ubuntu 1310 from a Canon T2i digital camera also known as the 550D. I come from a Windows background where I would install the Canon drivers, I would plug in and turn on my camera, and in the file browser under computer my camera would show up as a hard drive where I could copy the files off onto my computer. To install GPhoto 2 in Ubuntu 1310 we can use Synaptic Package Manager where we click on the All category and type GPhoto 2 into the Quick Filter box and install it that way, or we can much easier install it with sudo apt-get install gphoto2 in the command line. Once we have it, we can type gphoto2 dash question mark or dash dash help to get a quick summary of what we can do with it. Or we can go to the manual page using man gphoto2 where we'll get all the details on how to use it. The first thing we'll want to do is auto detect our camera. Now I'm going to turn it off to see what happens uh, when we try and auto detect without the camera plugged in. Nothing bad will happen. We just do G photo 2 auto detect. It doesn't find anything. You'll hear the click as I turn it on. Hit up arrow to do the same command. Hit enter and now it's detected our camera. It shows us the 550D. It's the same model as the T2i. Most times all I want to do is get my files. G photo to get all files. And that's it. I already have done this earlier, so I'm going to hit yes for overwrite. We may also want to list the files that we have. We can use dash capital L or dash dash list files. And we can see that the file that I just downloaded is still on the camera. That's the basic use case for downloading files from your camera. We can also do gphoto2 dash dash summary to find out what else the camera can do. And it says that we can't do image capture. That's partially true. If we do gphoto2 capture image, it'll seem like we're capturing an image if the camera can get focus. So you'll hear probably the shutter going off. It's telling us that it saved it on the camera, but it hasn't. If we do capture image dash and download, We'll hear the camera take a picture, it'll tell us it saved it on the camera, and it'll say that it's downloading the picture. If we look at the files in this directory, we can see that it actually did capture the image, but if we look at the camera, we'll see that the picture isn't there. That's okay. At least we know we can use capture image and download. That's the basic use cases for using GPhoto 2 on Ubuntu 1310 to download images from a Canon T2i digital camera, also known as the 550D.